and welcome to my channel. I'm Ginny, that's the name Ginspiration, and I just wanted to say hi before I got into my first video, but my first video is going to be a what's in my bag slash what's in my purse video, and so I'm just going to hop right into it. So this is my bag. It is a Urban Expressions Marty bag from Bag House, and it's in the color Bone, and I really, really loved buying this purse through Bag House. They were really great. They sent it in really great condition. It had all kinds of like packaging and stuffing in it. And it even came with a tag that said it wasn't tested on animals. And it had this really like fresh, clean, new smell, if anyone knows what I'm talking about. But it was just really, really awesome. I loved buying through them. But this bag has two different handles on it that you can use. One's a chain here. And one is like a longer adjustable strap. And you can unhook either one if you want to. I usually just keep both of them on, but that's just my preference. And then here on the back, it's got this zipper, but I never use it because it's just kind of inaccessible for me when you're wearing a bag. So I just still use that. And so in the front of it, you can tell that it's got all this like great braided detailing and some tassels, which I thought was really, really cute. And it's got this magnetic closure, which makes it really simple. You don't have to work with zippers if you don't want to and you don't have to try to find a buckle which is really great because I hate purses with buckles they just drive me nuts but okay so getting into my purse it's got this front pocket where I usually keep my cell phone my cell phone is an iPhone 3GS and yeah it's just a normal iPhone and I keep it in there and then this is the inside of my purse it's massive and it's got this really great I hope you can see this but it's got this really great floral detailing on the inside and it's super pretty but it's also got a zipper closure for the inside as well right here and you can zip this closed if you have something in here that you're afraid will fall out when you're opening up your bag but okay we're gonna get straight on in here this is my wallet that I use on a daily basis because I attached my keys to it and my rape whistle which I got freshman year of college because we kept bothering my RA saying that he never got us one and he eventually got us one. It was a long story, but if you ever want to hear it, just let me know. It's pretty, it's pretty funny. And I keep my school ID in the back, but I'm not going to show you guys that. I'll show you guys the picture, but I'm not going to tell you where I go to school or anything. Let's see if I can do that. But there's the picture if you want to see. It's kind of sideways, but yeah, that's my ID. And... In my wallet, I just have the cards and Ulta card for discounts, Sephora card for discounts, just things like that. Really simple. I can just kind of throw it in my back, throw it in my back pocket or something if I need to. And then I have my really, really, really cute owl case. That's also another Vera Bradley, but I got this at TJ Maxx, and I love this thing. And I was so sad. I tried to film this video before. But the second that I put my old sunglasses on, they when I took them off, they just broke. And I might put that in a blooper reel after this, I'm not sure, but it, it was pretty funny. <laughs> they just popped out. But these are some ones that I've had for a really, really long time. They're not my favorite sunglasses ever. They look kind of weird on me, but they're going to have to do until I get some new sunglasses. So hopefully I'll be getting some new ones soon. And then moving on, this is... Oh, this was a um, little brochure from a planetarium that I went to last night because my birthday is in like two days and my boyfriend took me out to a planetarium and sit dinner and that was really, really, it was really great. It was so much fun. We had a really good time. And then these are those Icebreaker Duo Fruit and Cool uh, mint type things. I have them in both raspberry and strawberry. And these are really yummy. One side is fruit and one side is kind of like the typical icebreakers mint, but it's flavored the same as whatever the fruit is. And they're really, really strong. Just saying, they're super strong, which I was not expecting when I first got them. I was like, whoa! But yeah, and then this is, this is a little Tinkerbell pouch that used to go to a purse that I had when I was little. But I just kept the pouch, and in here... I just have like little cards of people that I need to be able to call like my apartment leaser or 
like a taxi or something if I'm traveling because I don't go to school in the same state that my parents live. So I travel quite a lot. Alright, let's see. I also have some Bath and Body Works coupons because I just bought some stuff from there which will hopefully be in another video soon. I'm going to be talking about my May, Spring, Summer kind of favorites. But, yes, that's that. And then right here, this is, oh, this is one ticket to go see the Avengers. Another ticket to go see the Avengers. Another ticket to go see the Avengers. Another ticket to go see the Avengers. That's ridiculous. That's four tickets. I've gone twice with my boyfriend. So... We've gone to see The Avengers quite a lot. Love it. Great movie. Super awesome. If you haven't seen it, I suggest you see it. This is a Walgreens um, receipt. That's the word receipt. And a Walgreens coupon for contact lenses. Because I just went to Walgreens so that I could film this video for you because my batteries were dead. And I needed new ones. So I bought some rechargeable batteries. And then, since it is my birthday, and I have a Sephora card, I went to Sephora and I got this Happy Birthday Sugar Packet with a Mini Sugar Lip Treatment and a Mini Sugar Rose Tinted Lip Treatment. And these, these are really great. I've tried them out recently, and I really like them. The normal one is just this kind of yellowish type lip balm and they smell I think they smell kind of like lemonade but my boyfriend said they smelled like fru fruity pebbles but I don't know where he's getting that and then the sugar rose one is this red color right here but in my opinion it really does not go on red at all it's very 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 sheer tint kind of a very light red color like it just gives you super super little red and it's I really like that because I don't like red lips. So I was really happy that it didn't go on super thick. Okay, and then this is my hand sanitizer in Fresh Market Apple and my little holder from Bath and Body Works. And this smells like super sweet apples. It smells so good. I love using this. Okay, and then I have a Chewy Dips Bar in Chocolate Chip because I always carry one of these around with me because at work. I always need a snack because, I don't know why, I just get hungry, so I bring one of these with me and I eat it at work on a break. Oh my goodness, I have a lot of gum in here. Are you ready for this? Okay, we have Trident Vitality Rejuve in white tea. I love this. My roommate's mom last year, she got me onto this two years ago, and I think it's awesome. She gave it to me for Easter two years ago and ever since then I've just been like oh this is so good and I love chewing it it just gives you like a really a really fresh feeling and then I got this save the earth fresh mint gum and it tastes like spearmint and it's from Walmart and what what it does is you buy this and it buys a fruit tree and it, they go and plant a fruit tree which I thought was kinda cool it's kind of expensive for gum I think it was like three dollars but you know I, I just thought it would be kinda fun to do one time so I did that um, you're also going to notice I really there's a trend in the gum that I buy. I love Trident gum. It's my favorite. Um, this one's cinnamon. And this is probably the most non-spicy cinnamon gum I've ever tried. And I can't do super spicy. I can do kind of spicy. But I love that gum. And this one is Tropical Twist Trident. And this is my longest favorite gum. And I think it's really, really good. Super fruity. Great for summer. And then I just bought this one. I haven't even tried it yet. It's Extra Desserts, Dessert Delights in Orange Cream Pop. Now I've tried their apple pie and I've tried their mint chocolate ice cream and I liked both of those. So I'm kind of curious to see what this one, this one tastes like and it smells kind of orangey. I just, I don't know, I'm kind of curious because it kind of mixes in with the cardboard smell of the package and that doesn't smell very good. So we'll see how that goes. Alright, these are two more. Oh my goodness, I have so many movie tickets in here. These were for The Hunger Games on the night that it came out. And they're still in my purse. Goes to tell you, I have not cleaned it in a while. 
All right, and then here is another receipt from getting Mexican food. I love Mexican food. I'm originally from California, Southern California, so we have a ton of Mexican restaurants and they're always so delicious. And I was so happy that I found one here at school that was just as good. Now these are clean and clear oil absorbing sheets for when my face gets a little oily. I like to use these. You just kind of dab them on the places that are oily. Mine's mainly kind of my forehead nose area that I use them on. And I think these work really, really well. Okay, and then I have two pens. One's my boyfriend's that he didn't want to carry one day, so he gave it to me. And this one's mine. It's really cute. It's got these little, like, bicycles on it. And it's pink and teal, so I thought it was really springy looking. I'm not usually a pink person, but it's okay. I'm alright with it. And then I have... I know I have three lip balms in here, maybe. No, I only have two? Where'd my other one go? It disappeared! Oh well, that's okay. I usually carry around Vaseline with me because being from California, where I am now, I'm in Illinois. And I just, I love Vaseline for my lips because my lips get so dry. It's crazy. Then this is Revlon Lip Butter in Strawberry Shortcake. Comes in this cute packaging. And it's this kind of, I don't know, kind of a soft, rosy pink color. And I like it. It doesn't give you too much pink, but it gives you enough pink to know that you're wearing pink lipstick. And then I also have a Soft Lips Lip Chap in Vanilla. It's SPF 20. And I'd, I'd say it kind of smells like a vanilla Italian soda. That's kind of what it makes me think of. But I usually also have a lip gloss by Aquafina with me, and that's usually in Raspberry. Oh wait, I found it! This Aquafina Flavor Splash Raspberry. Yeah, that's my other lip balm that I usually keep with me. And then in here, this is my work ID, so I'm not going to show you that, but I have my work ID and my, iP and my headphones in there. And then I also have some mints and a Starburst from last semester. I should probably throw that out. But, and then I also, I always carry one of these around because I find that they're so helpful. There's one side which is this little hairbrush you can just kind of pop out and use. Then this other side is a mirror. I hopefully I'm not blinding you with that, but it's a mirror and I really think that it's a great thing to have with you. And when I was at Sephora picking up that um, lip balm, I got some other little samples. And so this one is Makeup Forever HD Primer because while I was there I also picked up, no it was quite a while actually. I picked up some Makeup Forever foundation and concealer, which I really think are great. Um, but yeah, I actually haven't used the primer yet, I don't know why. But it's still in there. And then I also have a, a I'm not really sure how to pronounce this, but I'm going to guess it's Josie Marin Argan Lip Treatment. And so I have that, I'm excited to try that out. And then I, I've heard a lot of great things about the Urban Decay De-Slick Spray. It's supposed to help with oil control on your face when you put your makeup on and all that. Help it last all day and not get oily. So I'm also really excited to try that out. And then the last one is another Josie Marin product. It's called Bohemian Waves Argan Hair Mist. So we'll see if that works with creating some nice voluminous waves. And that is the end of my purse. But I also wanted to share with you I actually use two purses usually. It's the one that I showed you already, and then I have this other one over here that looks like this, and it's just kind of like a cream brown and black purse with this kind of gold metal handle here and a longer strap that is really long and adjustable. And on the inside, it has the magnetic closures as well, and on the inside it has two different little holders and I think that's kind of cool if you want to just keep one set of stuff in the front and one set of stuff in the back to help um, keep everything separate that's always good but yeah this one I got at Charming Charlie and you can order that online or you can go to a store but um, I looked through the, through the store and I didn't find any more of this purse so they might have discontinued it I'm not sure but I was looking through and there are a ton of cute purses there right now. But yeah, so check it out if you want to get a cute purse like that. They're usually pretty inexpensive um, and they last really 
a really long time. I've, I've had mine for quite a while, and I like both of these purses a lot. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!